Everyone loves a bit of sponge, and Half-Life was one of the best games ever made. So let's do the most obvious thing and make a Half-Life cake. Begin by cracking your eggs and putting them in the mixing bowl. One at a time until you've done all four, trying not to spill half the egg on the table. Once the eggs are in the bowl, give them a good little whiz at about number 10, 5, 6, any number, it doesn't matter. Then add in the sugar and it goes in, but there's a little bit left in the bowl because the bowl was wet. And then some magic, some magic in the form of vanilla bean paste. Fantastic. And now we whiz it a little bit more, but holding the bowl because the uh, the nozzle doesn't actually go into the bottom of the bowl, but it doesn't matter. So we're now adding in the butter, now adding in the butter. The butter goes in, chunk at a time with your hands. Of course, should have cut that up, but it doesn't matter. In with the flour now. This might already appear to look like a disaster. It is a disaster, but it doesn't matter. We'll keep going anyway. And the flour, the sugar, the eggs and everything mixes. And once that's mixed together, you want to empty it out onto a prepared piece of uh, baking paper in, in a bowl with some butter on it. And uh, then squash that in, make it nice and uh, flat. Don't have to be delicate, just, just wham that in there. That's nicely done, very smooth. And uh, flat out a bit more, attention to detail. That's what, it's, that's what it's all about. Into the oven, make sure the oven's preheated at a moderately high temperature. I don't have an oven dial, as you can see, so we're just gonna guess. That's, uh, that's cooking at the limit, guessing. And then we put the timer on for one minute, two, five, ten. Ten minutes, but in actuality, it takes longer than 10 minutes, as you can see it wasn't cooked. So back in, and we're gonna go for another five, 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 ten 10 minutes. In total, 15 to 20 minutes. Now we're gonna cut out the cake for our shape, and we're gonna use a plant vase for this, which is the standard cooking equipment. Get in position, push it down, and we get a nice two rings. Now, uh, you might be able to guess what we're making here, but out with the center of the cake, and put it into, the, into a spare bowl. Careful not to break it. Now we're gonna put the shape to cut out our little logo, interior logo. And we're just putting that on, used it, printed it out. Now we're gonna cut it with a knife, cutting away bit by bit, because if we if we bugger this, then we're gonna to have to start all over again. So taking our time here and uh, removing the cake. Fantastic job there. Using the wrong equipment because I've only got a uh, the wrong equipment. So we're just using that, that's what we've got. Use what you've got, that's what you've got to do life lesson in cooking and there we go just separating it all out of the way moving it all off and look at that vaguely looks like the, the half-life logo it's good enough and we use a, a spatula and a knife to slide it in again the wrong equipment but you know what you're gonna do and look at that neatly done positioned and oh color look at that look at the beautiful sponge came out gorgeous could uh, could sell that in the shops and uh, now it's time for some decorating. Now we're gonna put some uh, some marmalade jam on this because that's orange and the Half-Life logo, of course, is orange. And it adds a bit of shine. And now we're gonna spizzle some uh, white chocolate on it just for a bit of extra flavor. And it's a nice to have a little bit of pattern on it. I, I thought so anyway. So we've got that going on, there you go. Just melted the chocolate in the microwave. Just got it all over the plate, made a complete mess of the kitchen. But you know, it's cooking. You've, you've got to make a mess. And there we go, there it is. Look at that, Marks and Spencers can pay for me to do their camera shots if they want, and uh, there we go. The Half-Life logo cake. Thank you to everyone that liked the Facebook page, getting us to 100 and making this cake possible. If you enjoyed this video, you might also enjoy a video of me playing Counter-Strike Go with a steering wheel. And of course, if you want to keep up to date with Gamer Muscle videos, click the giant subscribe button.